Okay guys, now I'm ready to install the uh, wheel spacers. So, um, now this is the rear left. Um, completed painting the uh, caliper. And um, this is the uh, wheel spacer. That I'm going to get that focus. Okay, come on. Okay, here we go. Right, that's the uh, size wheel space I have. And uh, so, what you want to make sure, guys, before you install, make sure that you clean this area right here so that your wheel spacer can sit nice and flush. Make sure you rub it. I use the uh, steel brush to rub and I also rub, uh, clean the uh, the surface area of the um, of the rotor. So this is just to make sure that the uh, when I install the uh, wheel spacer, it sits nice and flush. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, sit it push it here we go that's it so it's nice and flush so we're gonna go go ahead and install the uh, the tire and this is the uh, the balls that came with the uh, the wheel spacers so they are a little bit longer than the regular wall so if you can let me see if I can zoom look at that difference look at that difference so this is to to allow uh, the feeding to sit flush and uh, be able to clear the uh, the wheel spacer so that's why that uh, that bolt is so long so I'm gonna set the, uh, the tripod to clear the area so I can go ahead and uh, install the wheel this is a very it's a heavy wheel so I have to go ahead I'm gonna go ahead and wipe the inside just try to keep my wheels nice and clean okay here we go so I'm gonna sit in there there we go Ahead and raise the tape and set it up. Okay. Okay, one more time. One more time. A nice perfect fit. Here we go. Just one thing. So I'm starting them up with uh, hand tighten. So I just hand tighten them. Okay guys, this looks so nice. Looks really neat. And remember this this is from the uh, the wheel is from an E70 and uh, there's no fabrication on the wheel. Uh, fits perfectly. All you need to do is just to get the uh, the wheel spaces to you to be able to clear that that rim because it's it's nice and wide but uh, everything else it's it's set so I'm gonna go ahead and just nice
Okay, now I'm gonna set it down and then I'll talk it to specs. Okay guys, the wheel is already talked to specs and I got it some nice, nice uh, clean up on it. And uh, let's see the clearance, let's see how, how flush it is. Look at that, look at that. That is just amazing. That is so amazing. Look at that. And this is the uh, complete. Nice. So, guys, this project it's a DIY. You can do it from home. Uh, you, there's no special tools that you need all you need just get your wheel spaces get the size that you want and uh, you're good then welcome to my Shoko Motors uh, subscribe and uh, and uh, click the uh, notification button if you haven't so you can get some notification when I uh, upload the uh, videos thank you much enjoy it bye